Amount of Soldier system was designed to integrate with combat vehicle crewmen that operate on heavy brigade combat team and striker brigade combat team platforms. The Mount of Soldier system comprises of three subsystems. The helmet mounted display, the cordless communication system, and the microchromatic cooling vest. So basically, Mount of Soldier system is the end all that does all that integrates all of the soldier as a system components that soldiers are issued and they operate with in the field right now. Some of those items include the lightweight improved modular body armor, the fire resistant clothing, but additionally also integrate with all of the chemical and biological uniform items being used and issued to soldiers. When you look at the helmet mounted display, the helmet mounted display allows and offers the wearer the ability to select through multiple different prisms and maintain situational awareness and situational understanding. Situation awareness is very important because once you lose situation awareness, you leave yourself vulnerable for an attack. The cordless communication system was designed to allow the wearer to maintain constant communications back to his host platform, untethered wirelessly. So you don't now have to have a spaghetti cable that runs up to 30 feet, and that's the extent that you can actually operate from outside of your vehicle. The microchromatic cooling vest is awesome. It's, a, it's an item of equipment that allows a soldier to reduce his core temperature from what the ambient temperature is outside. I hearken it to this, you're on the inside of a battlefield system, whether it be a tank or a Bradley or a striker, and you're in, you know, southern Missoula. And on the inside of that vehicle, it probably ranges up to about 130 degrees inside of that vehicle. Well, with this microchromatic cooling vest, it allows a soldier's core temperature to be reduced to extend the soldier's endurance and also making the soldier more comfortable. I like specifically the fact that it's allowing people to get off and on the vehicle, keep awareness of the surrounding vehicle, I think it'll enhance the, the, the crew's ability to do their job a little better, time-wise, because it's all about time, because when you're in combat and there's any type of uh, uh, contact that you may have, you only have seconds to, to deal with it, seconds.